What's going on everybody? Welcome back to 909 Adventures. Uh, just something a little different today. Not quite a museum, but close enough. So we'll go ahead and put this down as another one in our museum series. The Brio Marina Aquarium. That's where we're at. And uh, real quick guys, if you guys want to check this out, it is technically free. But they do operate on donations and they suggest a $7 donation for adults, 3 for children. Oh, we got some sea anemones. Um, these? Yeah. They're not, uh, they're not moving around very much right now. They must have their, uh, their wave machines or their power heads off. Those are mussels. Mussels. I eat those sometimes. You eat those sometimes? They are pretty good, huh? No. Sea urchins? How small a crab gets, guys. An attached barn, whatever it is. Very crazy, huh? This one looks like a cow. Mm -hmm. It doesn't say exactly what kind of fish these are, but they're pretty. I guess they're the kind that swims. What if we find a Mino and a Dory? That would be cool. What do we got here? That looks nasty. Uh, yeah. That's how they eat. Really? Yeah. They're eating. Those are my baby. Look at, they're, they're nasty. Look at this. Nasty. Enemies. These are a little more active than the uh, other ones we've seen when we first walked in. They got their little power heads right there turned on. And some more coral down there. Oh, those are cool. It's like a clear uh, sea slug or Look something. It. Does it say what it is down here? There it is right there, whatever that is. Those are cool, huh? They look funny though. Look at, these guys remind me of the uh, the Venus flight traps. Mm-hmm. Those are stars. Those are like yeah, those are called uh, bottle brush. Bottle brush star. Brittle star. Brittle I guess that's what they call them here. Brittle scar. Look at those things. Mom, look at this. Oh, some starfish. More starfish. It's like another sea slug, whatever that is. Cucumber. Ew. Is it that fish in the Those are bat stars. Bat stars? Yeah, they're Oh, yeah. That's the uh, food for the snails, probably. Yeah. Oh, that's plastic. How do they even eat it? I don't think that's real. Oh, that's plastic. You don't think it is? Uh -uh. No, that's not real. Okay, so then the food inside of it is real. Maybe so. Maybe it just it like shows that, right? you how they eat, I guess. Oh, that one's moving. You can yeah. see it moving. Let's see. Watch out. You guys can uh, pause and read if you want to do so. <laughs> He's got a, a little shrimp walking on top of him. That's a prawn. It's a prawn? Yeah, like... Oh, yeah. Oh, dang, he's even bigger. <laughs> Why don't they be They're eating? ugly, we huh? We should cook one. Hmm? We should take one home and eat it. Yeah, mix them. Eat them. Tacos out of them? That's like scary. Look at this one. That he's looks like big. Yeah, he is big. Oh, of course. A, there's an octopus in here? Two spot octopus. Is it over? Is it in there? He's blending in real good. Yeah. Or he escaped. I heard they're really good escaped artists. Or they eat. What happens if he did escape? Because, like, you know the Finding Dory movie? <laughs> he escapes. Yeah. Oh, there's look at the eel. eel. Oh, there's crabs there. Look at the eel. He is in here? He is in there? He's in the I point there. Box. You can see his tentacles over there. 
Oh okay. yeah, he's just hiding. Yep, oh, here comes the waves again. Yeah, but they're not. Look at how big they can get. Yeah, they're ugly, huh? Mm -hmm. Did you guys see the sand dollars over here? Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Look at sand dollars. I like these ones. These are cool. Too bad they weren't real. Real sand dollars? Well, those, I think those are real too, but these are probably still alive. Yeah. I think a little starfish in there. Um, we need to see the thing cool. that's gonna hatch. I wanna see that. Oh yeah, Allie wants to show us the, the shark shark eggs, huh? Which way are they? Oh you're fine. Oh yeah, that's so cool. Look guys, it's a shark egg. There's little sharks in there. Oh, you want me to see. Look at their, their tag, November 6th, oh, wait, you could 2022. This one's for the That's October, January. Oh, that one's tiny, the January 1st one. Let's see what we got over here. How long do they take? I don't know. No idea. Well, he's pretty big right there. He's the biggest one. He's gonna be uh, getting ready to go pretty soon. Yep. That'd they be cool if one just like hatched right now. See horses. Oh, he's gonna let go. He's gonna let go. Look at his little back fin. How quick it moves. Uh -huh. Aww. Aww. Well, they're putting on a show for us. Check, check. Hello everyone, welcome. Thank you for joining us for our grinding hatching demonstration. My name is Keith. We have Alejandra, Aaron, and McKenna in the back now helping me with this demonstration. Uh, before we begin, I like hands. How many people here know what a grunion is? Show hands. A what? Not it is a type of fish. That is correct. We actually have some on display right here, some preserved ones. These are the adults. This is about as large as a grenade will get. Uh, they're close relatives to smelt, anchovies, sardines. And what makes this fish so unique is that they do something very extraordinary. While most fish lay their eggs in the water, these fish will actually come out on land to lay their eggs in the sand. Uh, in a little bit, we're going to give hand out these jars. We're going to ask uh, probably one jar per family. If we have enough jars, we might be able to hand out a few more. What you have in the bottom, we're going to have a little bit of sand, because I mentioned we go out and collect the eggs. So there's actually a little bit of sand, but there's also big grinding eggs in there. So we're going to add a little bit of water, and then we're going to actually do a little bit of stirring. And yeah, once you add the water in the jar, you're actually going to stir it like this. And that's going to be simulating the waves. Again, that's the waves is what activates the grunion to let them know it's time to hatch. So you can be a little bigger. So we will be able to do this in a little bit. Hey, Holly, we got one. Alright, we're all one family right yeah. here. Yeah. Excellent. Alright, let's get you some water over here. Alright, hold tight on this. You all think this is water from your kitchen sink? No, what makes a difference? Oh, that's right. Look at some. Look at Alyssa. Some are white and some are clear. Some are orange and lime. Look yeah. This. Oh yeah. Some Mine are orange. orange. You can see some of them. Shake it. Shake it. Oh, orange one. Look at. Oh yeah. He did. They're they're hatching. Look at him. Keep doing it. Shake it. Shake it. Yeah. Look at mine, there's like a lot of them. Oh, 
imagine. You see? <laughs> he got some. Do you hear everybody? Look at it. He got some hatching. Yeah, they're swimming. I have a lot. Let's see, Pete. It's a ducky. Let's see. Hold it up like that. Let go. Yeah, look at that. It Here, let so me see. Cute. I want to keep it forever. <laughs> oh, going crazy. That's cool. It's so cute. <laughs> it's like tornado. Dang, you got a lot in there. That's so cool. You can see all the clear ones that don't have any of them. You can see them. Look at You see a lot of clear ones. Yeah. Like, oh my god. I They're all clear. So much. No, some are. Like, oh, mommy. Oh, mommy. Caviar. Caviar? <laughs> We had caviar. I don't want you to try it. Me either. Look it. All right, guys. This is the aquatic nursery. Mm. Look at it. Go in there. Look Let that it. go. Daddy, this is great. Yeah, that's a duck. Looks like a duck. Look at this guy. He kind of spotted. Kind of seen him. Right when I walked in, it's pretty cool. A mosquito fish, freshwater tilapia. Oh no, this is a really big fish in here. A peely fish. There's no plaque stating what type of fish these are, otherwise I'd tell you. Now look at, there's uh, some sand crabs. That's what they look like in, when you're at the beach and the wave comes in. They're not very attractive looking, are they? Look, you can touch the shark. I know. It's so cool, huh? Yep. Shark egg. So, the Is shark egg is made out of the same stuff as like uh, your hair or fingernails. Let's see what we got. Oh, there's more little sharks. I'm assuming these are what is in the, uh, are these the eggs. eggs. They are. It's an octopus. Oh yeah, he's cool. That's a baby baby. Baby baby. Wow. Tiny one. Tiny one. The tiny jellyfish? The medium one. One medium one. Jellyfish. These are teeny. It's one like this where I wish I could. I want some jellyfish. Let's go check out these baby ones. Oh, there's more. There's more. Are they bigger? These guys. That's so cool. And this one just wants to give us a show. That's so cool. A Pacific football fish. I don't think that thing is alive anymore. Whatever, it is pretty cool. Another uh, moment for you guys to pause and read if you want to. Let's look at this. It's a Humboldt squid. And it's baby? Got a uh, taxidermy uh, sea lion. So during a full moon, and during a new moon, the tide is high, but don't run your note, it's time to go to the beach. 
So with the waves, swish, swish, swish. So now we're all mother grunions now. So we have to wiggle ourselves into the sand. So wiggle, 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 wiggle. Now we're gonna pause it up to 3,000 eggs. 1,000 with a whoosh, right? 1,000 eggs, whoosh. 2,000 eggs, whoosh. 3,000 eggs, whoosh. Now we're all gonna give the father grunions. Gonna give a little bit of a hug to tell Mama Grunion what a good job she did. But we're still fish, so we still need the water to breathe, so our job is done, so we need to wiggle out of the sand, so just wiggle, 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 wiggle. Now we need to go back to the ocean, so we'll just swish, swish, swish. All right, so now we're our duck rooms are done, but now the eggs are going to be for 10 days, so can you help us out? 10 days, so just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So give the tide is high again. With the crashing waves, all the little eggs are going to hatch with a pop. So you just pop, 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 pop. And now the baby bring it, have to go to the ocean. So with a little swish, 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 swish. swish. So now the babies are into the ocean where they have to survive in possibly in one year's time. They can possibly come back to the beach to lay their eggs again to repeat the cycle. So with that, everyone give yourself a, a round of applause. That's the world famous Gabriel dance. Now Start out the jars. Oh, so we can ask with just one jar per family. We have a few extra. Uh, maybe we can only just one jar. Yeah, why not? We. Whoa. Just... By the way, good job on the dance. Good job. Good job dancing. Good job.